Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve the Valorant system error. A critical error has occurred and the process must be terminated. Would you like to create a crash dump to aid the developers in troubleshooting the issue? This may take up to five minutes. Note the process may appear unresponsive during this time. So if you want to go about resolving this issue, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how. We're going to start by right-clicking on the taskbar, select Task Manager. If you see Valorant underneath Apps here, you want to go ahead and right-click on it and select End Task. So again, Valorant, anything that says Valorant underneath Apps, right-click on it and then End the Task, or you can select End Task down here at the bottom. Once you've done that, now we're going to go open up the Start menu and type in percent sign, Local App Data percent sign. A file folder should come back in the search results. Go ahead and open that up. And now you want to go scroll down until you get to Valorant. Double click on it. There should be a saved folder. Double click on that one as well. And then finally there should be several folders listed here. What you want to do is just highlight over all of them. Right click and delete. Delete them all. Close it here. Now you want to go open up the start menu. Type in services best match, it's a services listed right above app. So go ahead and left click on that. You want to locate a service that says VGC. So I likely will not have it in my case here, but again, it will say VGC, lowercase. Again, just three letters, V as in Victor, G as in Gerald, C as in Carl, and you just would double click on it. You would set startup type to automatic and then service status you would start it. So again you would do that for the VGC service. Again a very straightforward process guys. Select apply and OK. Then you would want to go ahead and restart your computer. Attempt to sign back in once you've restarted your device and then that should be about it. So as always thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope that I was able to help you out and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.